Hello, right, all right, all right. Welcome to another one about my son's World of Tanks Xbox 360 replays. Tonight we're platooned up with Graded Mosquito in his E25, Scavenger Bro, Scavenger Row 420 in his J Panther, Fatal Money in his T25, and Stealthy Number is KV2. I am in my KV3, and we are on Corellia. So uh, we're going to uh, move down to the back side here. And see what kind of hate and discontent we can create. There's a uh, T34 and a medium. I forgot T34 was the medium, and what was the other one? A Jackson. There we go. Off in front of us. I thought it was a T3485. Hmm. Some reason thinking about back to this replay, I could have swore there was a T3485 in front of us, in front of me. But I guess not. Maybe this is him coming up beside me. I could be completely wrong. I could be complete thinking about a complete different replay. <laughs> so it's a great possibility. That happens a lot with me. KV3. I'm actually kind of liking this tank for the most part. Um. If you get in a tier game, it's a darn good tank. It really has good armor if you're in a, you know, tier 7 matchup, so. Uh, tier 8, not quite as much, but, you know, that's pretty much how all tanks are, so. I, uh, tell the hood beaver to stay back and let them come forward so we can shoot from here. He decides to keep pushing right up. I see a teammate pushing on the right there. So I said, well, I guess I'm going to move up with him. T20, can I get a shot on him? Mm, yeah, nope. He backs up too quick. So I'm going to push back up forward here and try to get in behind this uh, T34. Keep my lower hull covered. See if I can get some shots on that Black Prince. We put a big 361 on him and destroy his engine. He's going to stay right there. There's a, uh, I believe it's a T20 coming to the right there. I put another one through the Black Prince. And there's a T20 shooting at me. I think the other one's a T25. 420 out of the T20. And there's the other one, the T25 too. So, I'm going to sit right here. I'm in a pretty decent position. They haven't damaged me yet. And, uh... Keep on bouncing some shots. They keep on tracking me, but nothing too bad. There's my first damaging hit, really. I wipe that T20 out. Next one is the T25. He's going to go pretty quick. Uh, someone else shot him. Bounce one off the Tiger, which kind of sucks. But I really wasn't aimed low enough, so I can understand why I bounced. Comes that Black Prince again. This one right here. Yeah, I think I should have gone through there, but... Eh, whatever. Especially when he goes through my turret just like that. Yeah, that was a BS on the part of World of Tanks. We're going to knock him out of the game. And now the Tiger P is pretty much by himself. And the team has rolled over the whole... I mean, they've... Pretty much raped everyone. Make a big chunk out of the Tiger P there. And like I said, the uh, team pretty much just rolled. It's one of those games where, you know... I mean, I have an okay game here, but I really don't like games like this. I mean... I don't know. I, I kind of like it because, you know, I, I did good and had a good game. However, that was a bad shot on my part, but the dirt there got in front of me and popped my gun up a little bit and I just couldn't get down where I wanted to. So he fires and I take that to a chance to move right out and get around him. And get a fairly low roll there. I mean, not a real low roll, but I've had over 400 rolls in this before, so. I'm gonna finish off the tiger there. And that's all we're gonna be able to do because 
like I said, the team, we only lost two tanks. <laughs> so uh, games like this is just kind of... There's no real challenge in it. And the, another reason why I hate games like this is because I'm probably, I would say, 80% of the time, I'm on the red team. That just gets rolled. Look at that E25 jumping mosquito. We were talking about that in the party. He comes flying across and he's like, it's skipping. This whole game, we were getting these little spots where it was skipping. It was kind of, doesn't happen very often, but it was happening in this game. But they're going to get up there and finish that guy off before I ever get up that way. So, But uh, yeah, games like this, I mean, yeah, it was a good game, I guess, but I don't think of it as, oh my god, that was such a fun game. I end up with 91,700 silver, basically. 5,200 XP with a multiplier. Couple rewards there. High caliber. 95 mastery badge. Steel wall. We knew that one was going to come. I was talking about that in the platoon. I didn't know I was going to get sniper. <laughs> Three tanks destroyed. Sergey, my guy's name is Sergey. Uh, we end up with 3,099 damage dealt, almost a thousand uh, with the uh, assisted damage. So I mean, that's 4,000 combined. That's a good game. So you know, 1691 for base XP, 12 shots fired, 12 hits, nine penetrations. Uh, we took 735 in damage, and like I said, we doled out over 4,000 combined, so yeah, it was a good game. I mean, when you consider the rest of the team there, I did my part. <laughs> so, um, I, I shouldn't complain about the game, but it's just, I like a game, I would rather lose a game that's really close down to the end than to win a game like this. So, you know. I'd rather have all of our games, win or loss, close, than to have three quarters of them complete routes like this and be on one of the other team, a team A or team B. But you know, hey, it's World of Tanks Xbox. As usual, comment, rate, subscribe, give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Tell me what I did right and tell me what I did wrong. And remember, when you're on that battlefield, shoot the red ones.